welcome. You look like you could use some therapy. Not from a wide-eyed circus freak like you. Hey, it's another one of the soda poppers. Me? Right, you're, uh... Peepers! I don't know what you're talking about. My name is Civil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist. Are you sure your name is Civil, not Peepers? Absolutely! Civil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist, that's me. He's trying to pull a fast one, Sam. Where's your gun? Violence is not the answer. Since when? Sam, we're dealing with a dangerously delusional psychotic here. Obviously. Sybil's normally a girl's name, isn't it? Must have been tough while you were growing up. Why do you think I became a licensed psychotherapist? <clears throat> Could we see your driver's license or some sort of ID? Sybil. My psychotherapy license is hanging over there on the wall. How about something with a picture on it, you obvious lunatic, you? I could draw one on there if it would put your mind at ease. Oddly, I don't think it would. You're a dead ringer for peepers from that old soda popper show. I get that a lot, but I'm civil pandemic licensed psychotherapist. Right. How about a little analysis? Certainly. Tell me what's bothering you. Every time I watch television, I want to shoot something. That's quite normal, but you might want to try Brady Culture's Ibo video. It's very soothing compared to regular television. Ibo? Yes, my runny, poached, egg-like eyes could use a workout. You won't regret it! Who's this Lady Culture person? Brady! Brady Culture! He's only the most insightful and amazing man on the planet, that's all. It's not Sean Penn? Not anymore. I'm so disillusioned. What's Hybro exactly? Ibo! It's called Ibo! It's a system of ocular exercises! So you can do push-ups with your eyes? Sort of. Just watch the video. Have you got a copy of this cockamamie video? I'm all out, but they probably still got a truckload or two over at Bosco's. Enough said. Excuse me for a minute, would you? Sure. Thank God. I've been locked in that closet so long I was starting to invent life stories for the mothballs. I've got to sit down. Oh my god, he's still here? Call a cop! You're in luck, ma'am. Sam and Max. We're freelance police. Civil pandemic. Licensed psychotherapist. Nice to know ya. Arrest that lunatic immediately! What's the charge? Assault! Kidnapping! Identity theft! Those are good charges. Some of my favorites! And what about Mopery? He locked me in the closet, and he's been pretending he's me! Gadzooks, why? Well, these cases can be very complicated and delicate. There may be repressed feelings of inadequate transference or latent unwarranted hypochondriac Freudianism. Come again? He's a complete whack job. Although actually, now that I look closely, I think he's been hypnotized. Great thundering jellyfish on the squishy road to mayhem. Hypnosis. Yep, that's what I said. Are there steps we can take? Soothing music, or perhaps some sort of invasive surgery? Shock treatment! Shock treatment! Typically, a hypnotic state can be revised after rendering the subject susceptible to new input. Sorry, I don't speak psychotherapist. You've got to knock them unconscious to bring them out of it. Knock them unconscious! Now you're talking! I can demonstrate on this guy if you'll knock him out for me. Consider it done! Hey, peepers. Sybil! Right. You're under arrest for kidnapping and impersonating a psychotherapist. Ridiculous! I'd never do that! After all, I'm a psychotherapist myself! You're definitely a psycho-something. Excuse me for a minute, would you? Sure! I 
can see you! Whoa! Where'd he go? Hey, there he is! You attacked a licensed psychotherapist? How could you? Just comes naturally, I guess. This guy's fast, and he's got good eyes, so I doubt I can sneak up on him. Take out his eyes, then! Thanks, you're a big help. Let's look around. Great idea! Where are we going, Sam? Let's go cruise for lawbreakers, Max. Goody! By the way, Sam, I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but I may have accidentally chewed through our brake lines. No, I don't think you did mention that. I guess we'll just have to slow down by violently rear-ending other motorists. Already planning on it, little buddy. Take the wheel, little buddy. With pleasure! Please accept my condolences for your tail line. freelance police. And you're not! Ergo, we call the shots around here! Oh, why did you stop me? Your taillight's busted. But you're the ones who broke it! Your point being... Hmm, what's the fine for a broken taillight? Why, isn't it $10,000? What? Are you crazy? Uh, okay, uh, one moment. Allow me to confer with my legal counsel. All right, my attorney advised me to pay the fine. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have some accounting. Thanks, sucker. We got your tear gas money right here. Really? All right, here you go. One tear gas grenade launcher. This is a salad shooter filled with onions. But it works. Trust me, trust me. Now put that away before someone gets hurt. What do you mean? The 10000 just covered the cost of materials, you know. Oh, I'm sure. It's okay, everybody. I'm all right. It says they've bred a horse with eight legs. Does it run twice as fast? No, but it does eat twice as much. It says cloning rights activists are cloning themselves to create a bigger voting bloc. It works for locusts.
Oh, Sybil? Yes? Uh, the other Sybil. What is that? Don't worry. This won't hurt a bit. No! <laughs> but it will make you cry. <laughs> Please, Sam, allow me. No, Peepers, this is going to hurt us a lot more than it's going to hurt you. Just kidding. It'll definitely hurt you more. Sweet dreams, Peeps. I can see you. <laughs> oh, my, that was great. That was great. Except, hold on. My evil plan is in jeopardy. Who dares to oppose me? Hey, that was pretty good. <laughs> better, better. Nice work, you two. Now I can try to bring him out of his hypnotic state. Take control of your mind! I don't think he can hear you. Sure he can. He's unconscious, not dead. Minor detail. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Regain control! What? Hey! What am I doing here? What's going on? Sybil? My name's not Sybil! It's Peepers! Ugh. Oh. Yes, it is. Are you okay? How do you feel? I've got a bit of a headache. I had the weirdest dream. And there was someone unusual in your dream, wasn't there? Yes, Brady Culture was there. He kept telling me to do stuff. Aha. Uh -huh. I knew it. That fiend hypnotized you to do his unspeakable bidding. Peepers, what's the last thing you can remember? Checking in at Brady Culture's home for former child stars. He has his own nut house? Wow, we gotta meet this guy. Where can we find this home for former child stars? Oh, that is secret. No one must ever find it. Think of a scandal. But we need to find it so we can stop the madness, in a manner of speaking. I want to help, but I just can't remember where it is. Oh. But my brother's mind. They went with me. Uh, hey, I, I didn't do anything really embarrassing, did I? Nothing a simple exorcism can't fix. Oh, dear! Hey, Doc. Hey, Sam. Thanks for taking care of that wacko. I wish there was some way I could repay you. Have you got ten grand? I'm new at this. I have a lot of student loans. Great! Loan us a student! I can ride it around like a pony! It's nice to see you show such enthusiasm! Security. Max might like a tattoo. Oh yeah! I want a map of the Netherlands on my Netherlands! I get the cold shivers just thinking about remembering hearing you say that. I'm out of the tattoo business anyway. I'm a licensed psychotherapist. Can you fix cars? Ours sometimes makes a noise like an orangutan with the dry heaves. Um, that's my fault. I've been keeping an orangutan in the trunk. Oh, never mind. I'm not much of a mechanic anyway, except with unicycles. I suppose you could psychoanalyze me. Hey, yeah, I could count your marbles for you. I have a license, you know. Will this be painful? Only if we do it right. Now, there are a couple things we can try. We could look at some ink blots, we could try some free association, I could interpret your dreams for you. How do ink blots work? And can we make them ourselves? It's easy. I just show you some pictures, and you tell me what you see. Your responses can reveal things like obsessions, or uh, obsessions. Take a look at this, and tell me what you see. Pennies on the eyes of a dead mind. Interesting. Now, how about this one? The St. Valentine's Day Massacre. And this? Coded love notes from space aliens. Alien love notes. Interesting. Now this one. What do you see?
20 nuns with machine guns out for vengeance. And this one? A war between two teams of abstract shapes. You seem fairly focused on violence, but it's probably nothing to worry about. Thanks, Doc. Actually, let's save the psychoanalysis for later. Hmm, postponing responsibilities. Interesting. <laughs>